Scientists are touting tobacco as the biofuel capable of weaning us off fossil fuels. In a bid to improve fuel production and reduce its costs, experiments are underway to genetically modify tobacco for usage by 2014. This is uh, the total lipophilic extract from tobacco leaves. Uh, we have uh, modified the tobacco leaves so that they accumulate oils inside the air spaces within the leaf. And as part of the protocol that we developed, uh, we are removing all lipophilic uh, products, including the chlorophylls and the other colorful compounds, and that's what you're looking at right now. At the University of Berkeley in California, researchers use algae to incorporate the necessary traits for heightened hydrocarbon biosynthesis. Treating leaves with organic solvents which enhance light utilization and carbon uptake, they can extract fuel directly from the tobacco. But there is another vital advantage to using tobacco rather than first-generation biofuels like sugarcane or soybean. Tobacco was to us a perfect one because it's not something that people eat. The infrastructure for growing it, harvesting it, producing it is all there. So we thought that that was an excellent uh, choice to make uh, fuels. As many of the crops burnt for biofuels are also used for food, there is subsequently less to eat. This has caused global food prices to rocket, pushing millions into hunger. Ambitious EU targets have also led to a neo-colonial land grab across the developing world, as companies seek to snap up fertile land. For once, maybe tobacco is the answer.